Mbeh Tazi Atawu IX led a delegation of expatriate Bangwa community members into Brown University's Hafenreffer Museum. On display were 19 ceremonial masks from his home region in western Cameroon. Some masks shouted beauty, others terror. As a child five decades ago, Atawu had watched his father and grandfather carve those masks. He hadn't seen them since. To be able to see things that go back in the family uh, and pieces that must have been made by my great-great-grandparents, these are, these are very emotional feelings uh, in me. But I remember as a child, picking up this mask and running around and... This very mask? This very mask. And I On this day in mid-June, the delegation came to share their native knowledge about the masks, the artisans, and the cultural heritage of the Bangwa community. They, they could, it could be adorned with all sorts of things. It could be feathers. There are many ways to decorate it. The members of this delegation are now part of a globalized community of Bangwa. And this was a homecoming in many ways and an opportunity for us to learn from them and for them to learn about these pieces and be reconnected. And now they're trying to look to these also as a source of inspiration, not only about their own culture, but also as a way of inspiring young people in the expatriate Bangwa community and in Cameroon to reinvent and to reinvigorate the arts there. An anthropologist collected them in the mid-1960s, and they entered the museum's collection in the late 1980s. The meeting of the Bangwa delegates and museum staff was meant to reconnect history, masks with people, people with place. There is still much to learn about these sacred masks and their creators, both to preserve knowledge and inspire the next generation of mask makers in Western Cameroon, and to deepen and enrich the research environment for students at Brown University. I think the significance of what we've learned today is to know that there is more still to learn about these objects and to start a dialogue with members of the community for whom these masks are sacred and to reconnect these pieces of history so that the objects are living again and not just objects on a shelf. But thank you all very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Oh.